Let's go on a couple minutes early and <laughs> play with my hair. <laughs> Isn't that what YouTubers do? We play with our hair. Does that drive you guys crazy or what? It drives me crazy and I do it. I also say um a lot, but yeah. My hair's kind of frizzy because it's been raining. So I got a thumbs up already. We're starting things off positively. Thank you. Oh, I got four. <laughs> Thanks, guys. You know I need some positive thumbs up tonight. Thanks. Hey, guys. How you doing? Oh, my contact lens just went bonkers. Um, I'm just going to chat for a second and then start right at 7. Um, um, because if you start early, you get in trouble. So let's, you know, wait for everybody to get in here. Hi, guys. Hi, Suki and Diane and Linda, Lucille, Foodie Mother Runner, Runner. Hey, lady. You're green, Foodie Mother Runner. You're green. You're green. Uh, Janine. Hi. Hi, Cheryl Meadows in Michigan, where my parents just bought a house. Uh, Mary Vitro, you're here. And guess what? I brushed my teeth. Uh, hey, Mary, will you moderate it for me? Hi, Heather. Hi, Brittany. Hi, Tammy. Hi, Kim. Hi, Lucille. We got lots of people in here. That's great. Uh, give me a couple more minutes. You're down 2.6 already? Foodie Mother Runner is down 2.6, everybody. What are you, weighing every day or something? Man, I had a run-in last night. We'll talk about that in a minute. Um, hi, Pamela and Cindy and Karen from Denton, Texas. We got a lot of Texans in here. You guys know I was born in Fort Worth. Ohio, Buckeyes. Very good. My husband used to live in Toledo. We moved around a little, just a little bit. Um, we got some purple plan, ladies. 2.4. Janine, that's fabulous. Please give Janine a hand. Donna. <laughs> Hi, Donna. Donna and her turtles. She always posts turtles. Cynthia, Pennsylvania. My mom's from Philly. Hello. Um, Estelle from Bama. Love it. Uh, Brittany's from the Toledo area. Very cool. <laughs> Linda is a pale Floridian. So am I. I grew up mostly in Florida. I had a guy once I was coming out of Chick-fil-A and I am glowingly, I'm a redhead. We're talking glowingly pale. I don't look pale on the screen probably to you guys because it's, you know, whatever. I had a guy yell at me, get a tan <laughs> in Orlando. So rude, but whatever. Um, hi, Ginger. Hi, Teresa. North Dakota. I love it. Hi, Liz. Wow, I got a lot of my old buddies in here. I love this. Very cool. <laughs> Linda. Ha, ah, you're too cute. I love it. Uh, let's show that comment. I don't, sometimes YouTube is like hiding comments because they're, uh, just so you all know, I know I talked about anxiety and depression last week and I gave out the suicide hotline. And so, yeah, they demonetize. They'll probably dem demonetize this for me saying that. Um, but also anything with kids in it, they're being, they're having us YouTubers hit a box that says that this video is not for children. Like that this video is not being made for children. They're really trying to protect kids. Hey, I'm all for it. Whatever they need to do. You guys know the current situation of our country. Whatever YouTube needs to do, you know, and my prayers go out to Los Angeles uh, tonight. I just want to say that. Um, and if you're the praying sort or the good vibe sort, um, I'd appreciate you entering into that with me. So, yeah, whatever YouTube needs to do. All right, let's get started. It's 801. I got real serious there. Um, but I had just seen on the news a little while ago what happened. So it makes me really sad for our kids. Um, I am still doing green. <laughs> you guys are like, Amy, what the heck is that? Oh, come on. You guys know what this is. What is this, you guys? Let's see. I always like to quiz you all. Um, MG started green today. I love it. We've got another girl in Ohio. Hi, Christine Murphy. 
Linda's a redhead too. Um, so this is beyond the scale stuff. So I just pulled this out today. I am going to put it in a different binder. So I really wanted to come on here because I'm getting a ton of questions about the binder that I take to my workshops. And I wanted to show you all because I've just gotten so many questions. First of all, let me just say that I will be doing a giveaway. I've had people message me and say, how do I enter the giveaway? I haven't put the giveaway up yet. It is coming. And that is because I need to go look at the new WW cookbook that has just come out because I believe I'm going to purchase it for you guys and put it in the giveaway. But I'm going to give you a little sneak peek of something that I did pick up. And if you watched my channel, okay, don't mess with the hair because it's just going to make it worse. Um, <laughs> let me show you what I picked up because I know I had you guys on the channel the other night while I was in Walmart. And I just want you all to know that after I clicked off that video, I reached up to the very top shelf <laughs> to try to get another one of these and an entire box of mini binders fell. Like I did the thing you're not supposed to do. Look, my son worked at Walmart all summer. He would be appalled. He quit, but they all fell like a shower. And I literally have a sore spot on my head where they hit me, right? And I looked over and there was an elderly, of course, elderly gentleman standing there like this, looking at me. And he said, job security. <laughs> I guess he thought I worked there. I don't really know. And then he said, do you know where the greeting cards are? He didn't like ask me if I was okay or whatever. He just like, do you know where the greeting cards are? And I gave him directions to the greeting cards. And then I picked up my mess. And anyway, I walked away from that with this planner for you guys, this little binder, this is a mini binder. If you guys follow me on Instagram, I live vlog over there and take pictures and all kinds of things. So I talked about this over on Instagram. This is from Pen and Gear. And Walmart has discontinued these. So I did pick this up. This is a three ring binder. I had a lot of questions about this. And you all voted. It was sort of an outstanding uh, vote for pink for other reasons that we're going to talk about next week when I show you the entire giveaway that has some other things in it that match this. Um, so, yeah, it's a three ring binder. Yes, you can buy a hole punch specific for this. Uh, I did not see one at Walmart, but I would check out Staple, Staples or um, Office Depot or Michael's. I am hearing that they carry these types of binders at Michael's, um, that you can find them on amazon.com. You can find them online. They are the one inch, the mini binder, one inch mini binder. Well, Amy, why is that size important? Well, it's important because you wanna be able to fit a sheet protector. Here's the ones that I use and the ones I bought for the giveaway. These are also from Pen and Gear. You can find these at Walmart. So what you want is a sheet protector, okay, so that you can fit your Weight Watcher items in the binder. Does that make sense? Um, so that's the size binder that you need. Now, maybe you're super crafty and can figure out how to make something without buying it. That particular binder, I believe, was either 388 or 488, something like that. Now, every January for like the past five years, Target's Dollar Spot has had these little mini binders, but they have stopped selling like in their office supply section, they have stopped selling the mini binders, but I'm, I'm thinking that maybe in January they might have them out. So let me show you what I do because I've had so many questions. I wanted to show you, this is my current mini binder that you guys have seen. I've just updated it and you're probably going to be appalled at what I did. But let me give a little background. I am a nurse. In nursing school, we had huge textbooks, huge, huge textbooks. So if you're a nurse, you know what I'm talking about. And we had multiple classes that we had to take our textbooks to because we had to highlight the sections as we were being lectured 
PowerPoint, the whole deal. So what we all started doing in nursing school was disassembling these huge textbooks. And I would just take the chapters that were being lectured on and I would highlight and take notes on those chapters. Um, and then after we were done taking notes and everything, when I got to my study groups, we would cut up our, our nursing textbooks and make flashcards and all kinds of things. We were insane in nursing school. Nursing school was the most intense situation in my life. <laughs> so I was looking at our newest iteration, which I was able to score another, these, another one of these from my Weight Watcher Center. My Weight Watcher Center is giving these out. And remember, they're a franchise. I know you guys are getting frustrated and upset because some give them out, some charge $15, some whatever. Just remember, you can go, if you're an online member, you can go online and print pretty much all of this stuff out under the My WW tab on the Weight Watchers official site. My last video shows you where to go on the Weight Watchers site to print these items out. So you don't have to have, you know, the printed items. Okay. But I do. So let me show you what I did. And I think you could totally do this by printing these things out. So I'm going to show you kind of how I section this out. Now, remember, I'm a scrapbooker. I'm a planner. So I have a lot of this. You don't have to be all crazy. And I got this idea from a lady that was at my meeting maybe a couple of years ago. Do you guys remember? I, I think I talked about it. She had this at the meeting, you know, and she just flipped it open, was writing her notes. And she had, you know, and I was like, what is that, ma'am? Because we, I'm used to this. You guys know what I'm going to show you, right? I'm used to this, the old carrier, okay, that just kind of had everything in there all loosey-goosey. Um, and I like this too. This is totally fine and totally workable. But, you know, I am a paper fanatic. So when you open this up, I've just put a couple things in here that were motivating for me. Um, I have some stuff I'm going to be writing in here. I wanted to write my why in here. I've had some trouble pin pinpointing down my why. Um, and that's a discussion for another video. <laughs> so we're not going to go there right now. I This came from the Target dollar spot uh, in January. Okay. So it was $3. It was from Target. It's the mini binder floral. They don't have these anymore, you guys. But that's what I'm saying. You know, wait till January. Maybe they'll have these out again. Or even during like school supply time. But Michael's apparently has these binders. So you open it up. I have some page protectors. These also came. You could buy these separately um, at Target. So I just put some cardstock on here. And this quote, this is what matters the most. So... What matters the most in this particular section is I have my new success planner. This is where WW is now at the workshops writing down our weights. Um, let me show you that. They write down our weights and our goals. So I have that in there because this is where I'm going to goal set and where my, my weekly weigh-ins are going. I have a before picture that I hate. But it's there because I have this out and I look at it and I'm like, I don't ever want to look like that. And it's not so much about looking like that. It's the way I felt in this picture in Hawaii that I don't ever want to feel like again. Um, I have my most recent five pound little card thing. I say things like this. I have my weigh-in book since this last rejoin. I put that in there. Right now we are doing a countdown challenge or a bingo challenge. So I have that little card in this pocket. So this is a pocket divider. Now here's what I did. I took the binding. <laughs> you guys, listen, my husband honors books with his soul. Okay. He would never, ever take the binding off a book. I did. So I took the binding off of this book right here. Okay. Cause I'm a nurse. I'm practical. So I read books on my phone. He reads paper books and he like smells them and things. <laughs> I hope he never sees this video. Okay. I took it apart and then I reorganized it based on what I want to look, look at basically. So there's the cover of it. But then what I put in the front was the three plans. And then it goes straight to the green plan for me. Cause that is the plan that I am doing. 
I don't have all the other plans in here. So I have my grain, grain plan. I have my little weekly meal plan in here. A couple tips and tricks that Weight Watchers gave us. Um, then that pullout card that has the green plan list. And then this is the top tracked foods. I took that out of the back. I put it right here. I put the grocery shopping list right here. I put my portion estimator right here. I put my flavor boosters here. I put my what's your why here because I'm still working on that. And then I just use one section to put the rest of it. So I still have the other plans in here, but I don't have them easy access, if that makes sense. Um, and then I ended the book. So there's the end of the book. Make sense? What do you guys think? Then my next section is a note section. I usually have a tab here. I need to go back and put that in. I usually have a divider tab here. These are my notes from the meetings. So I have that there. I don't know what all that is. <laughs> Sometimes I'm like, what am I showing everybody on the internet? So, oh, these are people. <laughs> these are people. Listen, this is an old list of, um, you might find your name on this list. Um, I think it was people that I was responding to or needed to respond to or something here on YouTube. Isn't that funny? That's an old list. Um, then I have another section. This is where my weeklies go, you guys. And once I get a lot of weeklies in here, I will double, triple, quadruple them up. But right now, I just have them so you can flip the page. Here's the recipe. Here's the weekly. There's only a few in here because remember, I just restarted. My other binders have huge sections of weeklies um, that need organizing. My next section, this is just like an area that I've done meal planning and weigh-ins before. Um, they're like calendar pages. So this all came from Target as well. Make every moment count. This section just has some sticky notes and some little um, paper clips and things for, you know, when I'm in a meeting. I've given people my phone number or I've given people my, you know, email, stuff like that in a meeting. Or I've put tabs on things. Oh, and then up here it says, you can eat everything. No, you can eat anything, just not everything. This is my coach, Tony's favorite, favorite, favorite saying. He says this every meeting, you can eat anything, just not everything, right? So, um, and then this is a little plastic pocket keeper that I have charms. I think I've shown you guys my charms in other videos. Um, this, this is a 50 pound charm that is a gold charm for me. I got it off of eBay. Um, this is something that I look at frequently to kind of remember where I'm headed, where I'm going. And then I know I've shown you guys this before. I know they give us out different charms and I have um, my other little new blue charm with my bookmark that I've shown you guys before. It's hanging over here on a magnet board so I can see it every day so it's not in here. But these are the charms that I've previously earned that I'm re-awarding myself. And then just some little charms I picked up off of Etsy I have an A for Amy. <laughs> I have this one that says, I can't read. Oh, I like this one. This was from the summer. Um, this one says, no more excuses. I love that one. Um, I haven't awarded myself anything except for this little five pounder right here. Recently, I've got my little five pounder. This, these are the old charms, you guys. I love the old charms so much. Um, and then <laughs> I have a bathing suit. Um, this is just sort of a reminder that the bathing suit is a reminder that I am going on a cruise in January. So I've been kind of looking at this and just kind of remembering a little small goal that I've set myself for the cruise. And then this one says, my favorite, you guys know this, don't quit, never give up. Don't quit, you guys, never give up. So I got this at a, like a Hallmark or something, like a, you know, like a little gift shop. It has my name on it. It clips on and I just clip this in here on one of the rings. Make sense? Hopefully that helped answer your questions. Um, the giveaway, I'm going to be giving away this binder. These little things are going, you know, they'll be inside for you guys. I'm not going to touch them. They'll just be stuck in there for you to do what you want with them. I also got some dividers, some page protectors, some paper. 
you know, this will all come packaged. I'm not going to tear anything apart. <laughs> Some stickers, lots of cute little things um, for you guys to put your own binder together if you want or use it for something else. You know, you don't have to use it for WW. But as I was going through my binders, I was looking at the old Beyond the Scale info, which this is the old green plan. This is Smart Points. And I was having a lot of fun kind of going through some of their ideas. And, you know, this is, it's like a more elaborate explanation of green. Like this eat better is really good. Um, and then just a basic meet your plan, which is kind of what we got. We got like a meet your plan, which is just a simple little blurb on green. Right. So, um, these types of things you can find on eBay, you guys, if you want old program materials, if you threw things out, a lot of stuff you can just find online. You don't have to be cuckoo like me and want printed materials. I just really, I think because of the type of person that I am, I like to have it. Um, I don't, I don't know what it is. It's like, I'm not sure. Um, but I, you know, I grew up, so my dad's a writer. I don't know if I've talked about that very much, but he is a writer. And before I went to nursing school, I was an editor and a writer. And I just like paper and pens and planners and agendas and magazines. And um, it's, oh, something's wrong. <laughs> so hopefully that helps you guys. Um, this week is going really well on green. I think probably just my biggest challenge is, is the usual thing, which is the stress eating. So last night I made a nice dent into my weeklies, um, but they're not all gone. So that's good. And I've just had a very, very stressful week. Um, I've, I've been seeing a lot of clients because of the holiday coming up and then I was out of town and then next week we have a work week. So we're not seeing clients. So I smushed a whole bunch of clients into one week and I love seeing them, but they're, you know, it's work. It is work, you guys. And it takes a lot of um, emotional intelligence and patience. And I do like a lot of motivational interviewing, if you guys know what that is. And just being present. And so sometimes I'll come home at the end of the day and just be like, you know, get in my belly. What is that movie? Get in my belly. Oh, gosh. Here we go. Anyway, <laughs> that's where I'm at. Um, but I'm totally on plan. I'm doing really, really well with water today. So thank you guys. I do have a Facebook um, little group, a little group over on Facebook of people I've just known for a while over on the N is for Nurse uh, Weight Watchers support group. So if you look me up over there, you can friend me over on Facebook. I'm under N is for Nurse. And then on Instagram, I'm N is for Nurse WW. So um, Rhonda says yesterday was her birthday. Uh, happy birthday, Rhonda. And you went crazy on the cake, right? And here's the thing. Here's the really great thing about WW is that we can have anything we want to eat. We just can't have everything. And so I probably need to have Tony's <laughs> quote, like tattooed on my forehead or something or on my hands or somewhere that I could see it so that you know, I just remember, Amy, you can have it. Just track it and move on. Stay within your points. Stay within your daily. Stay within your weeklies. Get activity points if you can. Drink your water. You know, just, you know, just go for it. You guys, we can do this. We have got this in the bag. Um, again, I want to thank Weight Watchers for listening. I'm very, very excited. Look at these stickers. They're so stinking cute. They're little cacti. All my plants are dead. They, they froze. Uh, let's see if there's any other little comments. <laughs> Dawn, good. I'm glad you like the little planner idea. Um, Sparkly Susan, yeah, I'm going to post this in a few minutes. So just watch it from the beginning. Lots of info on the planner. Oh, Cheryl, that's awesome. You're going on a cruise. I know that would be so fun to go on a WW cruise. I would love that. That would be totally fun. Oh, Kim's going on a cruise too. We got like the cruising community here on. Do you guys watch some of the cruising YouTubers? I do. I love them. Um, we're going to Mexico again. My husband wants to go see the ruins. And you guys have seen a video on that when we went last time. And we went to uh, the Yucatan. Yucatan? 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 I'm sorry. Progresso? 
Um, and we saw the ruins there and it was just amazing. One of the highlights of my life. So, um, <laughs> Liz, yeah, I, I was an A plus student, <laughs> but I was not an A plus student in high school. In fact, I got my like general education degree. I was, you know, troubled youth in high school. And so when I went back for nursing and I knew that I wanted to be a nurse, it's like something clicked in my brain and it was like, this is a choice that I'm making. So I just studied as hard as I could and just put everything that I had into it. Um, you know, and there were, a lot, it was a lot of blood, sweat and tears. Those of you guys that have gone to nursing school, you know what I'm talking about. Um, <laughs> Beth says, uh, Weight Watchers with Carrie put the PDF on her Facebook page today. Um, and Beth, you know, I, here's the thing with the PDFs. I want us to be careful. I know you guys don't like it when I say this, um, but remember that, you know, this is Weight Watchers and we do pay for their services. So just be, you know, be cognizant of that. Um, I know that we're all trying to help you guys out there. I'm just going to say that one time. Just be careful with that kind of stuff. Um, you know, I know if it's not for sale, it's not technically like a copy copyright thing, but I kind of wonder like, about the ethics of it. And I just want to be careful. So as your friend, I'm just saying that. <laughs> so, you know, just like we wouldn't post like chapters of a book or something from an author, you know, just kind of be careful with, with all that. So, um, and that's just Amy, the nurse get, using her mom voice. Um, Kim's going to Progresso too. I love it. Uh, Christy Cox. Yes. There's lots of, uh, YouTubers that cruise and give awesome, awesome, awesome cruise tips. I'm trying to think. Um, cruise Tips TV. They're an awesome couple. I think that's their name. And they travel all over. And she gives like the best packing tips and everything. So really, really awesome. Um, Dana Tuttle is saying the blue dot ranges have changed. They have changed. Yes, you're right. On on my WW, the blue dot ranges have changed. And there's a lot of uh, sort of controversy about that, which I thought was interesting as well. Um, Christy, welcome to my channel. <laughs> We've got Lenny Mace from Massachusetts. Love it. Hi, Kathy Vale. <laughs> Hi to New Jersey. I used to go to Paramus all the time. In fact, I used to have these people in Paramus that cut my hair and they did a great job. Okay, well, that's all I'm going to say for tonight. Yes, Cruise Tips TV and Lalito, Lalito Loca. Okay, Carrie Elliott, I'm going to have to check them out too. Um, Barbara, best wishes to you on your move. Hang in there, okay? I understand life is very stressful sometimes. So prayers going out to you. And <laughs> yeah, Paramus. Pram the mall there in Paramus. What's the mall in Paramus? It's like the best mall. All right. I'm going to get going. Have a great evening. Um, I do have a collab coming up Saturday morning. Saturday morning. What is today? The 14th? Yes. With a bunch of my friends that are on WW. I believe like Motivated Muffins and Chit Chat Paddywhack and all kinds of us are going to come on here and talk about our five little Weight Watcher tips for newbies, but then also um, I think it's important for us to share for, for newbies, kind of our tips, but then also just like things that are kind of fun to mention on this journey. And so you guys know I'm not an expert. I am not an expert. I am not at my goal weight. <laughs> I'm working on that. But um, just to kind of help people that are coming into Weight Watchers you know, tips and tricks that can help them. If you guys have any that you would like for me to share, I have not filmed that video yet. I need to do it tomorrow. Uh, let me know. And thank you, MG. You have a good evening too. I want to say thank you to all of my regulars. Hi, Luigi. Uh, hi, Texas Gamma. Uh, Mary, you're so funny. I'm a little bit red, aren't I? Okay, I will see you guys later. Stay in orbit. Come check me out on Instagram and Facebook. Say hi. Send me a message. Say hi. Um, and hey, if you have your old materials, get them out and be looking for the collab on Saturday. 
I'm doing a weigh-in. I'm not doing it on Saturday, though, because they won't weigh me because I weighed on Monday. So I'm trying to figure that out. I just got a hair go. I think it was a cat hair. Um, and what was my other video that I have coming up? Oh, the giveaway. The giveaway will be next week. So just watch for that. I'm going to do one video. I'm going to show you everything in the giveaway. You'll have a chance to enter down below. Um, you will have to be subscribed. So if you're not subscribed, go ahead and do that. Um, and then I will tell you how to enter. Okay. <laughs> Dana, I am excited. All right. Good night, you guys. See ya. Thanks for watching.